I think that everybody can take different risks at different points in their sort of journey in life, if you will. Um, and, you know, I think you have to decide if you were putting it all on the line, someone might call that reckless, okay? But if you were willing to do that, are you then willing to live with, you know, basically the blowback of that? And it's probably not just you. If you've got a mortgage and a family, it's probably more of a family decision. So I, I really, we, we talk about it in broad principles, but it really does, as you can see from this conversation we've had today, it sort of involves a lot of thinking that sometimes is unique to the situation at hand. But I think we could agree on the universal truth, you know, when you have nothing to lose, you know, go for it, right? And so for someone like me, it's really hard to be fearless because I feel like I have so much to lose. But I don't want to live that life. Like, that is just not going to be my life, okay? Um, and I know that you might look at me and say, well, it's easy for you to say because, you know, you've got to... But I don't have it all figured out. And actually, you probably have heard, do you ever watch like VH1 or whatever, you know, all those rock stars who had, you know, whatever, and they lost it all. I mean, you can actually do really stupid things no matter where you are in life. You can lose it all. The main thing is you don't want to lose your reputation, right?